my six man award as as um David Stern for the day. I have to it has to be a three way tie between Nip, Big Sean, and Currency. Jamal Crawford. Who's the Jamal Crawford of rap? Fabulous is the Jamal Crawford of rap. I'm putting all my money on J. Cole. I really like Yellow Wolf. Jay Z has a couple people in position to be that. I think that black and yellow is really undeniable. Like it's definitely I liked it when I first heard it and I like it more and more now and I feel like it's definitely like he did, you know, I, I think a lot of people like myself weren't really big Wiz Khalifa fans at first, but I think, again, he had his cult following and now he's winning people over. So I feel like, you know, to have a big record like that going into next year, it's like he's definitely even more set up than a J. Cole or anything. I definitely have to probably give it to Wiz. J. Cole obviously had a pretty big year, especially with the Miguel record um, towards the end of the year. Really, a lot of people checking for J. Cole. Um, and that, that could certainly happen. But now, Jay also signed Jay Electronica, who early in the year, way early in the year, had the monster hip-hop smash with Exhibit C. And now that he signed with Jay-Z, it'll be interesting to see what he's capable of. I mean, ever since I saw him on the Missy Elliott show, the reality show that he was on, he was kind of a special guy, and I think his I liked his Trunk Music Zero to 60. I'm looking forward to his new album coming out, so... I would give that to Yellow Wolf, and he's been doing a lot of big shows. I mean, he was on tour with Khalifa just now, who is just, you know, also out of here as well. And I've always looked at Fabulous as somebody who was destined for so much for bigger things. It's somebody that, at one point, I said, this guy can go for the throne. And he's very consistent. And lyrically, very, very few people could fuck with him. So I think that had he had an album out, it probably would have been all eyes on him a little more, but he just went underground and just killed the mix safe circuit, killed the cameos, and uh, I think he's definitely my sixth man of the year award. Next year, 2011, it's all about J. Cole. DJ Enough told you so.